Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to import image on Photo P website. So all you need to do, first of all, just go and open the browser that you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps. So of course, here in my case, I'm actually using Brave. But of course, in your case, you can use any other browser, such as Google Chrome, Opera, Brave like me, um, Internet Explorer, maybe if it's working for you, Firefox. I don't know. Just choose a browser that you use to... Uh, sorry so you can just go and choose whatever browser you're using or you would like to to use in this tutorial so of course when you open your browser just go here to the url and type photop.com and hit the enter button so that will certainly will take you into this page and from here you can actually create a new project opening some open something from your computer choose some of their psd templates or you can just drop your file right here and start editing on it for me i'm just going to click add new projects right here and choose one of their templates i'm just going to choose this one and let's just wait until it loads so once it loaded onto our page you will find every uh, component of this template right uh, here on the right and of course you can just click at any of them and start uh, like moving it or editing it do whatever you want even the background even the this one this layer of course you can do whatever you want so of course if you want to go back you maybe regret your choice or anything just go and hit the control z but sorry so just go and hit the control z button and you will certainly go into your home uh, or into sorry into the original case so of course if you want to import an image on this photo p website as we said in the beginning of the video simply you will need to click at this gallery option right here then choose whatever image you would like from here or you can choose by keyword let's say example we type sun and as you can see, you'll find everything here. If you want to choose any of this, just go and click on it, then close it. And as you can see, it's imported or it's inserted right here. So this will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching it. Goodbye.